not a bad view from the office here. Go down and see. There's this guy down here that does glass blowing. I don't know if he's here or not, but uh, give you another shot. Up there, you can see on the hill that's the hotel. There's a restaurant in there called the Asylum. I don't know if they're still open or not. There's a couple of restaurants. You see all the smoke coming out there. That's a haunted hamburger. Best damn Philly cheesesteak I've ever had. And I've never been to Philly. I've had Philly cheesesteaks imported from Philly. A friend of mine I used to work with brought them in. Left turn, Clyde. Down here. Huh? Down, down here. here. So down here at the bottom, and it sounds like something's going on, which is a good sign for us. There's a guy that blows glass. In this old blown out storefront of a place. And there's stuff going on. It's a whole artisan community. People come here. They live here year-round and make art. Oh, so that's what I'm going to say. But anyway, yeah. Oh, yay, he's here. This is cool. So, look, I love his sign. Glass-blowing demonstrations. Oh, he's doing it. 12-ish to 5-ish. We should all have such a schedule. So anyway, he's back here blowing glass right now. We're gonna give him a shot and see what all it looks like, dude, because it's pretty cool to watch. Pretty cool, so I'm gonna step right in here and we're gonna check it out. tail end. Dude man doesn't allow video so we got shut down but um, it's still pretty cool and you can see some of his work here. It's just absolutely gorgeous. What was the price on one of those mugs? 45 Gorgeous. Yeah. But again as you can see not a bad view from his office. Pretty spectacular. So this is the old Bartlett Hotel, the first two-story building ever in Jerome. That big old hunk of concrete right there. It's the old bank vault. And they got some funky old stuff down in here. Old toilets, there's an old sink. That thing's kind of cool looking actually. But apparently, people toss change all over their place here and I guess make for a wish. And there's all kinds of signs that say pitch in and expert pitch and throw your money. I don't know if they're using it for the historical society or what, but me and Tambra, I'm gonna switch hands so I don't look like I'm throwing like a gay girl. <laughs> and I'm gonna try to pitch it right there in the toilet. So wish me luck, wish me luck. Here we go, ready? <laughs> Hit myself right in the head. <laughs> That's why they call it expert. All right, let's try this again from a higher trajectory. That was so close. Yeah, I bounced off the roof, <laughs> whatever. All right, we're gonna go to the spirit room in the old Connor Hotel. Uh, neat bar, uh, lots of live music. And I've been here in uh, PJ's several times too, playing pool in the back oh, yeah. room. Lots of fun, good times there actually. And, uh, but we're gonna go to the spirit room. And as far as I'm aware, you can still rent hotel rooms here. Um, but they do a lot of live music here. It's a real popular venue. And this is one of the rumored places that Tools lead singer Maynard James Keenan plays. So anyway, we're gonna go grab a cocktail.